Hello and welcome to another video. Uh, this is the first video about how you can create uh, an application on Twitter and then use Visual Studio with C Sharp uh, to view your tweets or post tweets and all that good stuff. Uh, in the past, I have done videos about this, but the libraries that I was using, they're either not even supported anymore or they're too old. So I'm gonna do this video that will basically um, be using the REST API from Twitter directly from uh, from Twitter so without any third-party software or libraries uh, this section here callback URL this is just basic information I think I don't think you even need a real website but type something in here but the back call URL you need that because we're gonna be building an MVC application that needs authentication from the user and we need to call back so if to call back URL you need to create one your local host on your machine like for example in this VC studio that I'm gonna have a github um, link soon in the description all I did was create a class library like I did on the Magento series videos and it doesn't have anything yet so that's what I did a class library name it whatever you want and then I, have, I added a project an MVC project that's what you need to do to test this API but as you can see this uh, if I run this uh, project it's gonna give me localhost and a port number which is not helpful so make sure you need to set this one to start the MVC as a startup project not a class project so once we wait for this thing to load up, mm, as you can see, I have localhost 55559. So with this, you cannot get, Twitter won't be able to call you on your computer. So you need to make sure that you make this available to the public. So to make that possible, as you can see, this is just the startup template. But to make that possible, to make localhost in the port number available on on the public internet you need to have this guy uh, you make a secure tunnel to your localhost basically means that you're gonna allow it to go through this uh, servers service through your firewall into the client so anything you do uh, you can actually Twitter can call you back basically even if you're on localhost so if you don't know how to use this tool make sure you watch my channel I have a video about how you can use this service it's in the playlist for Shopify uh, how to build a web app for Shopify that's where I explain how to use this tool so make sure you go through it before you even try to uh, create a callback URL so stay tuned and come back I will have the next video uh, soon in the github um, link too thank you for watching